So um, I asked my son earlier, what do you want for dinner? And I could see him sort of hesitate. Well, I actually offered a dinner, but I saw him hesitate. And I just said to him, yeah, I see you've got McDonald's written all over your forehead. <laughs> anyway, so I, mean, I got McDonald's. But um, so on my way back, I was thinking in the Bible, in Revelations, you know, and it says... Um, People have the name of God sealed in their forehead or, you know, the mark of the beast is sealed in people's foreheads. It's it's kind of what's on your mind, you know. So for some people, God will always be on their mind. It will always be there, written in their foreheads. It's there. And same with the mark of the beast. So if people have taken that mark of the beast and it could have been back in 1300s they'll always have that idea in their head um, and the people who seal with God will always have that God sealed in their head and it doesn't mean their souls will be condemned but it's just part of the story that you know everybody plays their part and even who whichever part you're playing with you're for God or against God Eventually, God's plan will come out and everyone will be like, yeah, you know, God's the best. So, ciao, ciao.